Hello and welcome back to Cookie in the Haydens. I'm Carboot Chris. This is my stock room and we've got some orders to pick. So I've got 22 orders to pick out of here. They're going out tomorrow. Um, so I've got to find everything. I'm going to keep this running for the entire picking session. Let's go. Okay, so sports ones first. Sports jerseys. Uh, one that I only listed couple of days ago and I can't find oh there is that it bull taco uh, motorbike motorcycle racing cap bull taco that sold for 19.99 very very nice sale that one 19.99 that goes in the box what else have we got Sports caps. We've got come on. Uh, Miami Heat James and Dawn Boss. Is it that one? Robert Dawn Boss Formula One. That sold for fourteen ninety nine. Um, now I've got Miami Heat James Pat. Let me find it again. Which has sold for nine ninety nine. Le LeBron James. Let's see if I can see the colour of it. Hmm. Gonna have to get some out to find this one. Oh dear. Is that it? No. I thought I had it. Is that it? James LeBron. Yes, there it is. $9.99. So that is all the sports caps, I think. I have got a non sports one to pick, which is the next box down, Caps Other, which you might have recognised from Instagram a while back. I posted this, whoopsie daisy, this spiky hat, doesn't really suit me, that sold for 30 quid. £30. Nice cap sale, that one. Very nice. Had it a little while. You have to wait for the right buyer sometime. Sometimes, sorry. Sometimes you just got to wait for the right person to come along and pick your stuff. You can't just always sell everything straight away. Now, this is an interesting one. I'll show you once I've shoved this stuff away again. I don't think I need that box anymore. This is an interesting one. It's a Queen Mary 1936. It's not 1936, not made in 1936. But it's um, Queen Mary fleece blanket. There it is. And that went for £25. Interesting item. Again, it's one of them that, you know, it's not going to appeal to a large number of people, but just on the off chance someone is looking for something to do with the Queen Mary, um, they find it, you know what I mean? Oh, 
Oh dear. Right. What have we got next? Well, I've got some stuff from the $5 challenge to Aussie Thrifters. The $5, chal $5 challenge. Um, real nice sale here. Real nice sale. I only picked this up the other day. You might have seen it. I've posted it on social media. It's an Elmo Editor 912. It's like an 8mm eight, eight Super 8 film editor th thing, viewer. And that has sold for 50 quid. Got it in a job lot of camera gear. But it's gone for 50, so that was a cracker. Nice little sale, that one. And I've got something else from the $5 challenge. This challenge has its own box, that way I can stay a little bit more organised. This Spinosaurus Jurassic World figure. I took an offer on it and it went for £14. I've got that in a job lot of dinosaurs. Now I've also sold a, another Jurassic World which I might as well go for that now. It should have a sticker on it because it's not 100% working. It's not 100%, it's that one. It's got not working on it, I labelled it because I've got a couple of these same ones that don't quite, this one doesn't work properly. So that went on an offer for £7. So I've still got some half decent money for it, despite the fact it's not 100% working. Now then, I've got, I know I've got to get in here, so I'll stay on this stack of boxes. And I've sold this Care Bear, Funshine Care Bear, electronic. Batteries are out at the moment though for storage. Uh, and that went for 10 quid, 10 pound. So we're cooking on gas here now, we're getting somewhere. Let's see what else we've got. Couple of plushes there. Some figures. Okay, so I'm done on this pile. Don't need to revisit those. Oops, there we go. They are done with. Don't need any more from that. That can go up there. Because I need that stack in a minute. So I've got a t-shirt there. Might as well get that one. T-shirt, German rock band. T-shirt. So I'm looking for, this is going to be, this one might take a bit because I've got a lot of t-shirts. Fry Wild School Death German Rock Heavy Metal. So, you'll have to excuse me, I might not be on camera completely while I pick this one. But, because it's down here. So, let me just check what it looks like. Fry Wild, it's got those schools on the front. Okay, let's hope it's not too deep. Here it is. What did we go for? Oh, 16.99, Fry Wild. Sixteen ninety nine. Not bad. 
not bad at all. I think that's the only t-shirt that I need to dig out. Black Raiders. Come on, you buggers. Come on. I don't look like it's here. What's happening? Oh, here it is. It was at the bottom of the first one. So there it is, Black Raiders. What did I get for it? 30 quid. Quite a nice jacket, to be fair. Quite a nice jacket, that one. 30 pounds. These I'll just clump back in. There, because they're all nicely folded. Honestly. Oh, I don't think I need anything out of this pack. This pile of boxes. Because I don't think there's any more jackets. And they're all jackets. So, let's see what else we need. Right. Figures and stuff now. That may be beyond my abilities at the moment. Shut up. Every time she pipes up when I'm not even asking for any kind of assistance. Uh, this one went super fast. Sixteen ninety nine for Gunther Pop. Adventure time. That went for sixteen pound ninety nine. I got that in a big bundle of Adventure Time toys. It cost me hardly anything. So that's a nice little sale, of course. Let's see what else we need out of there. So I've got Walking Dead. Walking Dead. Paul Frank figures. Batman Key Finder. Quite a few bits. So... I know where the walking dead is. It's down here. Walking dead board game. Ten pound. I had it up for thirteen ninety nine. I've had it a while, I took an offer of ten pound on it. I feel like it should be going for more than that, but I think the market's just a bit flooded on those. So yeah, a bit disappointed at £10. I've still made money on it. I've still made some decent money on it. Percentage-wise, I mean, not actual decent money, but percentages when you look at them. It was still decent. some Paul Frank figures which I'm really pleased have gone because they have been a really bad buy. I ain't never buying them again. Just double checking that one just in case. Um, so I've got four Paul Frank figures all sold to the same person. It was in two doubles. Baseball, skate, pink and orange. That means nothing to you, but it means a lot to me. So, baseball, skate, pink and orange. Not that one. No. No. Gotta get all these back in. 
baseball, pink, orange, now I need skate, where's skate gone, there it is, right so those four, let me put these away and then I'll, oh, I'll come and show you, I'll come and show you what this is and what not to buy, ever, do not pick these up, waste of time, I still think I've made money on them to be honest with you but because I got them so cheap but I would I would not get them again not in a million years right so I sold these to 10.99 for a pair so they're called Paul Frank Julius figures so home run baseball and that's a skater edition at 10.99 and then design it yourself julius which are these plain ones pink and orange that come with a set of pens and you basically scribble all over them i don't care what you say right once you've put pen all over those figures it's gonna look shit isn't it it's gonna look absolutely shit who in the right mind is going to want to do anything with those and put pen all over them it's not going to end well is it now i want now i'm looking for batman key finder another one i've had for a long time got it don't worry i've got it so this is a batman key finder um what did it sell for 13.50 it came as part of a loot crate um i'm not going to get it out it's basically a batman figure you put your keys on the base key finder it's called Went for £13.50. I'm glad it's gone that one because I have had it quite a while. Um, what else now? What else? I've got, a, I've got a Disney Store Rapunzel and book. Let's get that one, shall we? Rapunzel and book. So these could go away. Because I've not got anything else in these. The space is quite tight in here, as you can probably tell. Which is... Makes it tricky. Uh, Disney cartoon, I think it's that one. It would be that one there. Would be, wouldn't it? Absolute idiot would be that one. Ugh. Disney cartoon. Rapunzel right, I think I've got it straight away I think it's this one because I don't think I've got another like this Rapunzel yeah some of these bundles I've had for ages so it, you get the book and the doll, the plush, and that went for eight pound, eight quid. Okay, so let's get these away. We have to tidy up as we're going along because we don't have the room in here. Uh, 
then put things back. Okay, next one. I know it's a bit boring for you because I'm having to sort things out, but this is just, this is my, welcome to my life. Picking orders and having to deal with all this. Right, I've got some plushies. I've got a Watership Down Rabbit. I've got another Ad Adventure Time tree trunks. Is that it? That's it, two plushies. I've seen tree trunks straight away. That were easy. So he sold Adventure Time tree trunks. Fourteen ninety nine. He's gone. Let me make sure you guys are still actually watching. Yeah, you're still running. Look at you. <laughs> Adventure time. Right, fourteen ninety nine for that plush. Cost me very, very little that one. And then Watership Down Rabbit. <sighs> it's there. It's in the same box right next to each other. That was a stroke of genius that's it and that went for 14.99 as well hazel the rabbit so got 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 i'm getting to the end now of me picking got 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 all right i've got a cycling jersey which will probably take me ages to find Cycling jersey, a Japanese baseball jersey. Look at those. I've got this. Nagasaki. Nagasaki jersey. Blue pinstripe. Should be able to see that one fairly easily. It's blue pinstripe. Now, a lot of them are pinstripes, to be honest with you, but I actually haven't got many pinstripe ones left. It's not that one on top. Not that one. Is that it? Is it number 15? SSK Vintage. There we go. This one went for £21. Baseball jersey, 21 quid. These are ticking over really nicely, these Japanese jerseys. I probably sell a couple a week and they are ticking away nicely, normally between 20 and 30 pound. So yeah, and I've still got a ton left. Literally a ton left. Got a full box of Japanese jerseys. got now I've got a no fear motocross tracky top right now I should have got this earlier I forgot about it so I'm hoping it's in this one yes it is I, I weren't sure about this after I bought it I thought to myself this is probably gonna not be a great buy because it's no fear and it's not a massive brand but this has gone for 10 quid it's a motocross um like tracksuit top it's quite nice for what it is but i let it go for a tenner i've made money on it that's the main thing isn't it oh i'm worn out oh, keeps you fit anyway this Keeps the old six pack rolling. I think I've got one more item to go. Or is that it? Is that it? Right, hang on. Got. Remember at school when you used to have the football cards, football stickers, paninis? And you stand there in the playground and you go, got, 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 got. So this is what I'm going to do now. So got, got. Got, 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 oh, cycling jersey, need, need, got, 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 so just need, 
the cycling jersey i always leave these to last because i've got i've got like a hundred of these left uh right so it's blue primal rvhs now i've not got many blue ones i know that oh for god's sake it was on the top of the other one it was on the top of the other side there it is what did it go for 50 this is one of the lowest price ones i've sold 15.99 this went for there you go that's it so that is it for my picking session these are going to be packed up first thing in the morning and then i'm going to get them posted out to their buyers um, in total there 22 items i picked total sales value of 375 quid that's it really if you liked it please give us a thumbs up that really helps with the old youtube algorithms um leave us a comment as well that also helps i'll always reply to every comment i'll like it and i'll reply to it i promise um other than that we'll see you again soon thanks for watching take care